I'm Sierra. Uh, I am the nursery manager here at Meadowview Research Farms. I started in April of 2022 as the landscape maintenance uh, specialist and I then transitioned into the nursery manager position. So as the nursery manager, um, I'm basically taking care of baby trees and so what that includes is, um, you know, I'm getting the pots ready, putting the seeds in the pots, taking care of them until they sprout, and then throughout the growing season, seeing them become tall, young sapling trees. That includes, you know, fertilization, um, checking for pests, integrated pest management is a big part of my job, um, and just generally making sure that these plants grow big and tall so that we can get them out there into the field and forest. So we get a lot of our seeds here from our own uh, tree orchards, chestnut orchards, uh, where we go and do controlled pollination during the early summer. Um, and so we're specifically taking uh, pollen from one tree that we're, we want to create and adding it to the flower of another tree and creating their offspring that way. And so that's we produce a lot of our own seeds that way and we also provide these seeds um, to others who are planting their chestnuts and planting our chestnuts and getting them out there that way. Actually, I would say that my chestnut moment came before I was even on the East Coast, before I had even entered the Eastern Hardwood Forest or Appalachia. Um, and this is actually what I wrote in my cover letter when I was, you know, applying for this job. Um, I read the book Prodigal Summer by Barbara Kingsolver. And in that book, there's a character. He's kind of a curmudgeonly old man, but he has this passion for American chestnuts. And it's a story about he, how he's doing his own breeding. Um, and I just, I really enjoyed that book in general, but also that, that part of an individual doing something that they felt was so important um, and adding to something larger than themselves was part of actually what propelled me into continuing on with environmental science. Um, and so I was, I was actually, I was just elated to see that there was an opening at this organization that I didn't actually know was in our area. Um, and I found myself here and I feel really lucky that you know, I now get to see these trees and the process that we're going through and, and seeing the story pretty much from, you know, its past and now into its future.